Nine peeps, it's your boy MPV, Michael, Chief Sonic, Pickles, Terminator, whatever the fuck you call me. I got so many fucking names, it's not even funny. I need, I need to keep a fucking list. And, um, you guys like my uh, Evil Brain Angel Heart came I made? On my KN? It's pretty cool, huh? Anyway, uh, let's get right to it. <laughs> um, so, uh, I know I've been talking about a lot about um, Call of Duty 4 Remastered coming back. We're all excited. It's pretty clear. It's being overshadowed by or it's overshadowing Infinite Warfare and uh, I guess I should talk about end up what the fuck was that? Hold up. Oh shit, it was behind me the whole time. Whatever. Okay, so <laughs> I guess we should talk about Infinite Warfare and give you my thoughts. So, um, I mean, I already talked about you know what? Okay, no, I'll just say it. And uh, what the fuck? Man, fuck this game. You know what? I'm just gonna run and say it. Hey, actually, don't look that bad. The trailer don't look that bad. I watched it a couple times and I was expecting fucking guys jumping 5,000 feet up in the air. And yes, I did see the dude thrust and jump in the uh, beginning of the trailer. I did see the spaceship. I did see the robots. It actually don't look that bad. I mean, the thing that surprised me the most is all the fucking hate. Holy shit. The thing's got more dislikes than likes. Holy shit! Go on the trailer on you, their YouTube page and look at the like dislike ratio. Holy shit! <laughs> uh, and I I understand the freaking hate. I mean, people want to fucking go back to a modern or even World War II setting. Yeah, it's just accept the fact it's probably not gonna happen until at least probably when Treyarch comes back until like what 2018 or 2019. Like, cause I think Sledgehammer after Infinity War they're gonna fucking make Advanced Warfare 2. So, I mean, of course, and this is coming from a guy who not really into that sci-fi space ship and shit like that. I mean, all we saw is just the campaign trailer. And actually, I'll be honest, the campaign looks actually interesting. And of course, we all know why I'm getting the fucking game. And, uh, oops. oh shit, I already killed him anyway. Oh shit, there's another guy, hold up. <laughs> I fucking love this gun. This is probably my second gun, second favorite gun in this game. Behind the Cuda. <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah, I mean, we all know everyone's going to buy the Legacy Edition of this game just to get Call of Duty 4 Remastered. And Call of Duty 4 Remastered is being developed by Raven something, I don't remember. I mean, I heard of them. I mean, they've been around for a while, so. And I guess the best part is going to be by Dedicated. How the fuck did I not kill that guy? I fucking shot him first before his butt buddy killed me. So, um, you know... It may be, be, it might be a good game. I mean, I can understand the hate, but come on, you guys are fucking giving shit on a game, and we haven't even fucking played it yet. We just saw a fucking two-minute trailer. Give it a break, man. Come on. At least, it, you know what? I'm at. You guys remember the video I made about a month or two ago about uh, my thoughts on the COD community right now? And I will be honest, I was actually nervous for Infinity War because I mean, with all the new management, with all the shit they're dealing with. With the full three-year cycle they had on this game development, I'm I'm liking what I'm seeing so far, and I'm not into this futuristic bullshit. But shit, I mean, some of the pictures I'm seeing in other planets looks freaking awesome. I mean, just the graphics. I mean, of course, it's just the trailer. So you know what? Let me give you a little history. You guys remember when Modern Warfare 2 got revealed back in 08 or 09? And the part where they show the astronauts in space and everyone lost their shit and we were thinking, holy shit, we're gonna be playing a level in space. I can't fucking wait. And it was actually a freaking cutscene in the actual game. I mean, to be honest, I think the actual trailer in the, ah, oh, fuck, I fucked that wrong run up. <laughs> Damn, that shit took me flying. I think the trailer in space was longer than the actual freaking game. And people got pissed. So now that Infinity Ward said that they've been wanting to do this for over like six years, now you're all pissed. Like, what the fuck? They're doing... You guys want to change since Ghost, and you're getting the change. Well, pff, you know what? Kind of in space, Infinite Warfare might be fun. Who fucking knows? And I'm not hating, but so far, I'm liking what I'm seeing. I'm not in the space. I'm not a sci-fi person. I'm more of a reality person. Like, I want a freaking World War II game. I want a modern game. And to be honest, we're getting, like, we're getting that shit back. We're getting boots on the ground. We're getting a COD 4 remake. I mean, I'm probably going to play that more than Infinite Warfare. I mean, it, guys are acting like it's the end of the fucking world. It's a fucking game. I mean, I use this just for as a hobby. You guys treat it like it's fucking life and death.
<laughs> oh my gosh, we're gonna invite him Oh, I'm actually positive. That never happens in TDM. Oh man. What was I saying? Oh yeah. So just give it a just give it a chance. I mean we're probably not gonna go back to a boot sound. I mean they were talking, you know, if you watched the live stream the other day and saw the, uh, the whole thing, they kept referencing boots on the ground in Infinite Warfare. Now, I, I don't know why, because I saw the trailer, I saw a couple guys thrusting, and to be honest, it looked exactly the thrust jump from Black Ops 3. It, not too crazy like Advanced Warfare, not fucking 500 feet up in the air, but it's just like a little thrust, and there you go, just to get over objects. And with that, I didn't see any wall running, so I'm actually cool with that. So, I mean, just give it a chance. If it's, you don't like it, then you don't like it. If I'm not going to like it, I'll take that shit back. I'll just play COD 4. That's the game that got me into Call of Duty. So, yeah, I mean, we'll just have to wait and see till when November comes out. God damn, so far away. I'm just, I just want COD 4. So, just give it a chance. I mean, Infinity War is giving us a lot of content for just 60 bucks or 80 bucks here. Plan on spell. I'm pretty sure everyone's gonna spend 80 bucks just to get COD 4. And they're, what really surprised me, they're bringing zombies. I mean, I thought they were bringing Extinction from uh, Ghost, but I mean, I didn't really get into Extinction, but I mean, I heard a lot of people have fun. And I just thought they'll have bringing Extinction because, you know, it's outer space, aliens, it could be shit. I don't know, but zombies in space, actually, I don't know. I mean, what could go wrong with zombies? Making a zombie. I mean, I thought Sledgehammer with the Bands of Warfare did pretty well. To be honest with you, I mean, not as good as um, Treyarch with their uh, own zombies. I mean, they're, I'm pretty sure that's always going to be the best. But I mean, we will have to wait and see. I mean, you're getting zombies, you're getting campaign, you're getting multiplayer, and you're getting Call of Duty 4 remake. So you're actually getting a lot. Infinity War is giving us a lot. So just stop hating on the game. We haven't even fucking played it yet. I just want to fucking point that out. So I mean, I understand you guys want. A fucking modern or World War II setting, but it's not gonna be for like a couple of years. And holy shit, that was a good game. How did I do? Ooh, I went positive. Let's go, baby. All right, so yeah, just want to say that. Thanks for watching, and um, catch you guys next time.